Hey guys, Natural Progressive. Um, I just decided I have one more thing to say. I just have a prediction. Um, I'm not big on the horse race and all the politics as far as who's running for what. I have no confidence in our election system anymore, so I really don't want to discuss that. But I do have something to say about the the shutdown and the compromise they they made to keep the government running for a little while and I'm going to make a little prediction um I don't know I may be wrong I hope I hope I'm wrong but I think that the democrats were holding out because all of our eyes were on them during the shutdown and they knew if they compromised at that point it would be bad but I think they're going to go ahead and give Trump money for the wall while everybody's eyes aren't on them. Uh, now that they've got the government running temporarily, I think in the meantime, they're probably going to make some kind of compromise for that. Um, I hope I'm wrong. <clears throat> we really need to utilize all of our resources, military and otherwise, towards climate change and not towards the wall. That's not doing anybody any good it's very divisive and it really isn't going to benefit anybody our immigration our legal immigration is at a 40-year low and the <clears throat> the illegal immigration is coming in on legal visas and overstaying their visas that's the majority it seems like a lot of people are coming over the southern border because they're really focusing on that right now. But that's always happened. And it is <clears throat> going to get worse. It's definitely going to get worse with with their crops failing, with the <clears throat> wars over oil, with the drug cartel. Um, it is going to get worse. But it's, you know, that's that's a minor problem compared to the ending of our planet. Uh, I don't really, really know what to do about that. I mean, they really need to just ship in a whole bunch of judges to process the refugees as quickly as possible, but it's not going to matter. We're all going to be having wars over resources any minute now. Um, climate change is real. It's happening before our eyes. If you can't see that, you're, you're putting your head in the sand, you're you're not paying attention. If you can't see that there's severe drought, severe fires, flooding, severe storms that are totally extreme and 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 bigger and and in different places than than they used to be. Honestly, the wall is the least of our worries, but the Democrats aren't going to represent us. They're not. And the Republicans obviously don't. There's they're just two sides of the same coin. They're 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 all establishment. They care about themselves. They don't care about the people. And we need to change that. We need to get the power back in the hands of the people and hopefully save our planet in the in the meantime. So those are my final thoughts. I don't know. I might have another video before the weekend's over, but I think I got most of it out of my system. I'm going to have a very busy week again, very physical. I do a lot of physical labor. Um, I'm not a desk jockey. I do not that there's anything wrong with that. Work is work, but, but my work makes me extremely exhausted by the time I'm done, uh, very physically, mentally totally exhausted so i'm going to try to do more um hopefully tomorrow but in the meantime just just hold that thought and see what happens with what the pelosi and schumer do and and watch them closely in the meantime because i think they're going to try and make a deal um now that the shutdown's over i, I don't think they wanted to do that during the shutdown they wanted to make that trump's liability and not theirs. But now that it's over, while no one's paying attention, I think they're going to try to make a deal on the wheel, on the wall. So, um, I don't know. I guess we'll see. We'll just see.
anyway, have a very good evening and we'll talk to you soon. Have a good night.